Dr. Strom, where they take it seriously. Pomp and ceremony galore, even for a rescheduled game. They've changed the time and made it happen here in Potter Strom. Almost successful last week against UCT before an interception try at the death by Duran Kuvert turned the result against them. Zero points on the board as a result for the new for the NWU Eagles and zero points on the board for UWC who are heftily beaten by an impressive Schimler side. High tempo they're playing at as well and now into the gap. It is for Lender over the line for the try. It's Peter Williams in the end and UDEBS, they're looking cold. Good patience, good shape, great dummy line. He should have been taken but it was a mismatch. Bertrams couldn't hold on, what an offload, Williams. First blood. Paolo feeds. Important line out for the Eagles. Didn't look too tidy, but it has been made good by Andre Fushir. Under pressure now. UW's wrapping around is Bertram powering towards the line. The arm is extended. Try given. Yep, at home players are finding it really difficult to stop. The tall Heinz Bertram, the way he holds the ball in contact, he leans in, always leaning through arms. Scored one very similar in that five meter area. Paolo sets it back for Hanas once again. Peterson on the loop. Look at that for a kick. Onto the ball is Porta. The offload <laughs> out of this world. And Hanas is in for the try. It's spectacular business. And this is the way to do it. First real opportunity for them, total skill, class, style, call it what you will. Brilliant finish as well from the scrum off, Genes. Paolo feeds a pressure line out, the Eagles take it clean at the back and they set a rolling mall from there. This spells trouble for UWs, let me tell you, so much field to work with for the Eagles should they keep it in or break free. Paolo's at the back, over the line they go, it's a power play from the Eagles. They now to Maul out here. Look at that. Perfect loft on it. Great timing of the lift. Andre Fouchier controls his pot beautifully. Fantastic from the tall men at the back to hold the fort in those pillar positions. And look at the patience from Vernon Paolo. Knows when to strikes. Strikes once. Hanas keeps delivering it quickly. The grabber through is for Van Niekerk to chase Van Niekerk. Putting masses of pressure, but well dealt with by Tian Haneke. Away from Van Bouillon, the short ball. Delayed the pass for oh, 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 yes. <laughs> the lender to the outside. And it's Williams jogging his way in over the line. Run the replay. <laughs> Run the replay. Williams finishes off easy as you like because no one left in front of him. What a fantastic slight touch of hands from Lyle Hendricks, the captain. Brilliant. And Williams gets in for his second today, third of the season. Sure. Right to the front, Swart feeds, the take was good, they oh! fumbled it! My goodness! What was that? A bogey, a mistake, after all that hard work on their line. A lapse of concentration, good pressure from KG Woodbridge. Muffy came born, Pretoria boys, high school boy. There he is, he's behind, he puts just a little bit of pressure. It's turned into a KG affair after it was an absolute tri-fest in the first half, but Van Niekerk is always happy to run, and that's off to Heinrich Porta. Porta beats Philander on the inside, and they keep it alive through Erlang Genes, back to the outside. Oh, yes. It's a picture book try. Van Niekerk is in. What a try by the home team, and the reaction from the fans is elation. Excellent. FNB Varsity Cup Rugby at its best. This, the first of two matches on your World of Champions this evening. The home side, the Northwest University Eagles, making good on their efforts after a defeat last week to UCT that broke the hearts of their fans. This time around, they came to the party in the final 20 minutes, and the Oaks and the Oquettes made it happen for them. They got over the line in the end, Mtunzi. Well, what a game here at Poch of Strum. It was fantastic at the final to Toy Stadium. In the end, the Eagles win at home.